All right, Maguire. Gonna take it in the old Viper. Taking the green machine to the races, starting P7. Got a great lap time in here, but I'm gonna start with hard compound. I'm gonna do about two or three laps and then switch to the soft compound. It looks like you have to use both tires for this race. So that's what I intend to do. Tire wear is 10 times. I think that'll put me ahead. 15 lap race. Maybe I stretch it the first seven or eight. Let's see how the lap times run. Of course, GTR Nismo at the top here. The key in a long race like this is to get into a zone. Zen moment in. Really like that livery on Jose there. Beautiful color. May the downforce be with you. What the heck? All right, let's get one for Team Viper here. What is happening up here? Man, people in their dirty race and they just can't get enough of it. go. Just need to build a gap. Let's go. Oh boy. Not my intention, Jose. God, what a beautiful looking livery. Now we're going to take a two second penalty here. Which is deserved. Oh, nice. That's fine. You know, that whole thing about driver's etiquette just kind of goes out the window when people are pushing on you. I'm going to take a two second, it's going to tank me here. Yeah, two seconds, there it is. P7 to P10, look at that. P11 now. All for that nice little rear end which wasn't really my intention but we'll take care of it and there's always mistakes here it's important to know when your car you can let off the gas and when to hit the brakes I know it sounds like basic driving but when you get a flow of your car and you know what this car does What his characteristics are like into a corner. When does the when does the tail slide? It really helps with your application of throttle. Got to bring the speed through here. We're on hard compound, so it really kicks you outside. There we go, good speed here. Good speed here, there we go. Keep in mind we're gonna try to get about a little over halfway before we get into the medium compounds.
Good speed here. Starting to pick up the pace. I never do this corner right. I always break early here. Because I like to set up my inside route on this corner. Good speed. Picked up a second. We're back up to P8. Okay. And as we start picking up the speed, look who we find. Jose in that beautiful livery. Just glistening. Hopefully we can get him in our rear view here soon. Perfect corner. Perfect corner again. Let's go. I'll accept that. Oh, I got a mistake up here. Oh, it looks like somebody put Snow Jay off. Is this my opportunity? Not yet. Don't have enough speed coming through that corner, unfortunately. Oh, I'm gonna hear I'm gonna get him again. Oh my god. There we go. I thought I was going to hit him again. I thought he was going to collect another penalty. Until I put on the medium tires. Mm, don't follow too close. They'll make their mistakes here soon. one perfect here's the difficult part about this corner everybody wants to take it late let's try taking it early see what happens that's better that's much better just like this one we want to take early The great news about the Viper is it's very compliant. It's very flexible. If you have too much speed going into a corner, don't hit him. Oh, come on. Don't tell me I'm going to get that. Of course I am. Never mind, he, he takes himself all the way back on the track. Never mind that. You're kidding me. Two times so Jose has burned me with penalties. That wasn't even my fault. Gotta get through the engine problem here. It may be in our best interest to consider a pit. It's a three second penalty anyways, I might as well serve it in the pits. Come on. Unreal. Unreal. He starts making this mistake. I should have slowed down. But we can curse him all we want. Watch him not even get a penalty for coming off the track either. Wouldn't that be something?
Yeah, this is gonna be a key one. I hope you go off the track. That's not sportsmanship, is it? Well, chasing the super silhouette here. You will make a mistake on this corner. I was right, he took it a little too wide, but I wasn't there for it. So I'm two seconds behind while the hard compound tire are my best lap time. We're just over half the race is in. And we need to pit yet. I mean, technically it says pit is not required, but you do have to run both compound tires, so you really have to. It's the only reason why anybody's pitted so far unless the tire just fails. We're gonna do one more lap. Just a second off our best lap time so far anyways. It's not like we're losing speed. Good pace. We're gonna have to concede here. Good speed, good pace. One more lap. Steph is just nipping on her heels here. Yes, flawless. Flawless sector one. And he is right on me. I'm not sure I could have done that sector one much better than I did. 
follow it up with a nice corner here. Staff is on me. going to pass this up here. We're going to hit the pits. Oh, don't collide. Well, the pit's only 10 feet long, so it should take longer than 10 seconds to get up to the guys, right? Mind. Thank you. Go chase down Alcheron. A little slippery and little slidey here. Just take that pace up. There's nothing I love more than driving my Green Viper. See if we can crush that lap time. Uh, somebody's made a mistake up here. And that's gonna be me if I'm not careful. Can we get a two for? Can we get a two for up here with these guys? With four laps to go. This is really where the Viper excels. These nice corners here. Right now we're we're right where we started. And we've got a few laps to see if these medium compounds are gonna give us the speed we're gonna need to finish this race in, in a podium position. Will somebody make a mistake? Will I make a mistake? I don't feel like I'm going to make a mistake at all. Other than maybe an occasional overuse of my boundaries. Bringing in the speed here for P5. Trying to avoid a collision. Oh boy. Gonna try to avoid it. Took it real wide. I'll take it. Boy, was that a heroic move. This is all the room I need for this corner here. Perfect. Coming for that P4. I'll accept a P4 result if I can get up to it. P3 is so far ahead. Mr. Steph. Who is running a blistering lap time. There we go. 
Can we catch Mr. Yerf? Let's go. Does the Viper have it in it? Of course it does. Last lap. No mistakes here. Start thinking about the the colliding with another car penalty of two seconds. Three second penalty violation for doing it again. Both times with the same driver. And that five second gap you're down by. You're in the mix with that race car driver. At least six seconds ahead of me now, obviously, but... It makes something that cost a one second too slow on the lap time. That's me. I'll take two P5 finishes though today. I think everybody in front of us, oh, maybe not. Someone to get a penalty. They did. <laughs> One minute penalty, you forgot your tire change. I'll take P3.